I came from Cameroon, oh, that's in West Africa. I've been a registered nurse here at the U.S. for five years. I was diagnosed with diabetes back in 2011, and that has been a challenge for me, coming from a family with a strong history of diabetes and really not being aware that the reality is once you have a parent or a family member who has diabetes, your chances are very high of getting it. So even though in nursing school you learn that it really didn't hit home until I actually got diagnosed. I have actually lost quite a few family members from poorly managed diabetes. Losing loved ones has really put it in my heart to you know, help raise awareness, help fight against it, help help teach people to manage it. And that's why I have this passion to become a diabetic educator. My mentor, Michelle McBride, um, who is currently a certified diabetic educator um, here at Shady Grove Hospital, and the Project Beat It program have definitely played a huge role in helping me attain my goal. So Project Beat It is um, a project that is under the Center for Health Equity and Wellness at Adventist Healthcare. The Beat It Project provides training and education to healthcare providers that work with African immigrant patients, as well as education to African immigrants in order to break down barriers to care and help them live healthier lives. The Beat It Project has made me more culturally sensitive as an educator and also a more effective mentor to Fende. So even though I am Fende's mentor, she's taught me a lot. Recently, Fende put together a Word document for me. It's a list of common West African foods that I use all the time when I have the opportunity to educate African immigrant patients. Working with Michelle really helped me to take, again, this information to myself. And it has helped me with eating right and also living a healthier lifestyle as far as exercise goes. Since I started exercising, I have lost weight. I was 224 pounds before I started exercising and I have dropped down to 176 pounds in just four months. That's why programs like Project Beat It are so important because they empower educators as well as the community and the African immigrants to live healthier lives.